In today's video, we are diving into the intricate world of property finance to answer the question, is it better to remortgage or release equity? Stick around if you're curious about how to make the most out of your home investment. Before we dive in, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. It shows your support and helps us create more content like this. Remortgaging and equity release are two popular ways homeowners can unlock the value in their property. However, these options can be complex and will depend on your circumstances. Remortgaging essentially means you take out a new mortgage to replace your existing one. This is often done to secure a better interest rate or to borrow more money. On the other hand, equity release refers to the process of freeing up the cash tied in your property. It's a way to access the money tied up in your home without having to sell it. When deciding between remortgaging and equity release, you need to consider your financial situation. For example, if you're struggling to meet your current mortgage payments, remortgaging may be a better option. However, if you're retired and own your home outright, equity release could be a viable option. It allows you to access the wealth tied up in your home without monthly repayments. Equity release might seem appealing, but it's not without its drawbacks. For instance, it can be expensive and can reduce the amount you leave as an inheritance. Remortgaging isn't always a bed of roses either. You might not qualify for a better rate, and there could be fees involved in switching lenders. It's also worth noting that both options can affect your tax situation. Therefore, it's essential to seek advice from a financial advisor before making a decision. Both remortgaging and equity release have their pros and cons. It primarily depends on your personal circumstances, financial goals, and long-term plans. In some cases, it might be better not to touch your mortgage at all. This could be the case if you're close to paying off your mortgage or if you have a really good interest rate. One important thing to remember is that your home is probably your most significant asset. Any decision involving it should be made with great care and consideration. We hope this video has given you some insight into remortgaging versus equity release. Remember, it's always a good idea to speak to a financial advisor before making any big financial decisions. Before we wrap up, let's revisit the importance of liking, subscribing, and commenting on our videos. Your engagement really supports us and allows us to keep providing valuable content. So, if you found this video helpful, please give it a like and remember to subscribe for more insightful videos. Your help is greatly appreciated.